is, um, what is your plan for reducing health care costs for individuals and families? And then also, how do you propose um, decreasing medical costs overall for our nation? Yeah, yeah. Well, you know, half of our bankruptcies are now medically related, as has happened with your, your sister. And, it's a, and I can tell you, when I've gone door to door for candidates all over the state, my role is as a Democratic leader. Uh, I would always ask a question on the door, what is the issue that concerns you most? And uh, during the last uh, four years, up until this recent financial crisis, the answer was health care. Because families who have health care are worried about losing it, and those without it, or making the co-pays, or so, so forth as, as you're facing. And uh, those without are, are, are simply worried about getting sick, or, or they're sick and, and how to pay to get well. And the um, I think we need to have a plan that fills in between the existing plans that breaks the cycle, the downward spiral, uh, in which uh, people without health care uh, wait to an advanced state of disease. They go to the emergency room. Uh, the costs are, are the most expensive way to treat a disease. Uh, those costs get transferred onto those with health care. The price of health care goes up. And uh, then uh, employers are pushing to either drop the health care altogether or to push a big share of it onto the, onto the worker, which often workers cannot opt in and can't afford to do. And the whole price goes up, and then we repeat the cycle. 